Hey everyone, Matt here from Akai. Today I'll be going over scanning contact into VIP and importing your expansion maps. This process will also apply to other plugins. The first thing we'll want to do after opening is bring in our plugins. Navigate to the settings button and select plugin manager. The plugin manager contains all the information regarding your plugins and maps. At the bottom of the manager, you will find the locations that VIP is searching to find that information. We can search up to two folders at a time for our plugins. The folder I have listed here is a custom folder where I store all my content. If you let contact install to the default location, you should scan the following folders instead. To the right, we have our user maps folder, where you can store custom patch mapping files. This will be set to a default location upon initial installation. Let's hit scan. You will see plugins starting to populate in the manager. There are different categories for the plugins that provide necessary details for their use inside of VIP. We have the in-use category, the plugin name, the manufacturer, how many default patches are included, the maximum inputs and outputs, the validation category that determines if the plugin has been scanned successfully, the download status that indicates if maps are available to download, and the in-use map boxes. To make sure the plugin imports, make sure the use box is selected. You may have noticed that contact 5 is listed three times. This is due to contact having three plugin files, each one with a different amount of outputs. If you'd like to only use one, you can either right-click and hit clear scan to remove it from the list, or just click on the use box to disable it. With Contact, in many other plugins, you may have expansions or additional sound content. To obtain mapping for the expansions and content, we will need to click the arrow next to the plugin name to show the maps that are available. I currently have the factory content installed, so I'll just check the In Use box to make sure it is imported. Once everything you want to bring into VIP is selected, begin importing. You will see VIP importing all the content. After everything is finished importing, you will see your plugins listed as well as their patches. If you select any of the patches in the list, you will notice the parameters are already mapped. If you notice that some of the patches are not mapped, or your expansion is not listed, you may need to download the map. Navigate back to the plugin manager and extend the list for the proper plugin. Find the correct expansion in the list and select the map download option. Hit OK to bring the map in. You will now see the expansion I selected appear under the expansion category and the patches are mapped. For further troubleshooting and walkthroughs regarding the VIP software, navigate to the links in the description below this video.